This spring, an unusual band of insects will make its first appearance since 1996. Once every 17 years, cicadas across the northeast U.S. emerge from the ground to fly, mate, and lay eggs. And, of course, to make noise. A few weeks later, they will all be dead, having completed their life cycle in a brief flurry of activity above ground. But the offspring of this year's insects, known as brood two cicadas, will burrow into the soil and emerge once more in the year 2030. There are 15 different broods of periodical cicadas in the U.S., each emerging in a different year according to its own synchronized life cycle. Twelve of the broods have 17-year lifespans, but the southern U.S. also hosts three broods that live for 13 years. The 17-year cicadas in the north are divided into three different species, each with at least one 13-year counterpart in the south. So even though all the cicadas in a given brood share an exquisitely synchronized life cycle, they are not necessarily all the same species. All the periodical cicadas derive from a common ancestor that lived about 4 million years ago. And as each of the three cicada types, decim, cassini, and decula, has evolved, it's developed its own distinctive mating call. Decim, sometimes known as the pharaoh cicada, has a call that sounds a bit like the word pharaoh. Cassini emits a rapid series of clicks followed by a buzzing sound. And Decula has a longer call that builds up slowly. In some years, such as 2014, the life cycles of a 13-year brood and a 17-year brood will overlap. But because 13 and 17 are prime numbers, those two broods won't overlap in time again for another 221 years, in the year 2235. Researchers have a number of ideas for why the cicadas developed lifespans that are large prime numbers. But one thing is certain. Get a good look at these fascinating creatures while you can, because they won't be back anytime soon.